hello everybody this is not a crypto expert chiming in with another video and in this video I am going to install the Bitcoin wallet using the ledger live software I'm installing it on my nano uh, my ledger nano s I've already updated the firmware on this device um, I've also set it up obviously as a new device as well as configured it as, as a previous device just to check just to make sure that how seamless that process worked um, but right now let's go on ahead and let's install the Bitcoin wallet onto the device so I'm gonna switch over to my ledger live software and you can do this one of two ways you can either go from open manager or you can click on the manager link on the left but they both get you to the same place um, and it's going to prompt me to unlock my device so my pin code is already typed in so I'm just confirming it now alright navigate to the dashboard there was actually something that came up before telling me to install apps on the device that's why it hung up on um, this option right here uh, but once I press the two buttons to go past that where I was on the setting screen that's when basically the dashboard uh, that's when it authenticated the device and now on my screen I've got an option um, that says allow ledger manager I just have to confirm it by pressing the uh, right button for the check mark and now I am inside of my device so I'm gonna install the Bitcoin wallet just click on install now one thing that I noticed um, before I made the video was that this device does not tell me what is currently installed on the device. I don't remember if the, um, or excuse me not the device, but the program itself. I don't recall if the Chrome based apps showed which devices were already installed on the device using the software. However, if, if you're not sure, you can always look at the, uh, at the device itself it has a Bitcoin icon or whatever wallet that you're installing it has that icon on the dashboard that you'll be able to see um, so at this point you see that the the install is finished it was you know less than a few seconds I'm just gonna press close and now like I said I've got a uh, Bitcoin icon on my Nano S which should be on the screen right now now I'm I'm going to go on ahead and uninstall it since I'm here you know just might as well show you how to do an uninstall reinstall it's basically the same process you know you um, pull up the software plug your device in type in your pin code uh, navigate to the dashboard uh, allow the other uh, manager the ledger software to authenticate and then uh, click on either portfolio and go to open manager or click on the link and go to the manager and then instead of clicking install for Bitcoin you would just do the other uh, trash can for the uninstall and just like that the software has been removed from the wallet so really quick video on how to install the other uh, Bitcoin or well, uninstall and reinstall the Bitcoin wallet I'm probably gonna do uh, a quick videos on all the ones that the ledger uh, devices have but with that being said folks I hope that you're having a great morning a great afternoon and a great evening